Stephen Harper is a retired Canadian politician of the Conservative Party. He also has belonged to the Reform Party and uh, the Canadian Alliance, two now defunct right-wing and populist Canadian parties, <coughs> who most notably served as the 22nd Canadian Prime Minister from February 2006 to November 2015. He was the first Canadian Prime Minister to come from the modern Conservative Party of Canada, which was formed by a merger of the Progressive Conservative Party <clears throat> and the Canadian Alliance. He was elected to the House of Commons of Canada uh, first uh, in 1993 as the federal MP for Calgary West re representing the Canadian Reform Party. He did not seek re-election in 1997, instead joining and later leading the National Citizens Coalition, a conservative lobbyist group. In 2002, he succeeded the controversial Stockwell Day as leader of the Canadian Alliance uh, and then returned to Parliament as leader of the opposition for the riding of Calgary Southwest in Alberta. In 2003, he reached an agreement with the new progressive conserv conservative leader Peter McKay for the merger of their two parties to form the Conservative Party of Canada, which could then successfully challenge the Liberal Party. In the 2004 federal elections, uh, he led the Conservatives to a solid second place finish uh, and helped to reduce the uh, Liberal ruling Liberal Party to a minority. He then joined the two other opposition parties, the New Democrats and uh, Bloc Québécois, uh, in voting no confidence against the Paul Martin Jr. government uh, due to the sponsorship uh, scandal controversy in um, November 2005. <coughs> in the ensuing snap federal elections of January 2006, he led the Conservatives to victory, although they only received about 40% of the seats. Uh, he was a minority prime minister all the way until the May 2011 um, federal elections, although in the 2008 uh, federal election the Conservatives had come within 12 seats uh, of getting a majority. He did win uh, 166 seats out of uh, 308 in the uh, May 2011 federal elections. The Conservative Party was clearly defeated by the Liberals, led by Justin Trudeau, in the October 2015 federal elections and then uh, following the defeat he resigned as party leader. In May 2016 he was named as a board member for the Conservative Party's fundraising arm. He moved back to Calgary, Alberta and commuted to Ottawa as an opposition backbench member of parliament until August 2016. Andrew Scheer was elected as the next Conservative uh, Party's federal leader in May 2017, while Harper was elected chair of the International Democrat Union uh, of various conservative and center-right parties in February 2018. Uh, he belongs to the Evangelical Christian and Missionary Alliance. He graduated uh, from Richview Collegiate Institute in 1978, aged 19. Now, Harper was born in uh, April 1959 in Toronto. <coughs> he enrolled at the University of Toronto but dropped out after two months, then moving to Edmonton, Alberta, where he found work in the mailroom at Imperial Oil. Then he advanced to work on the company's computer systems. He took up post-secondary studies again at the University of Calgary where he completed a bachelor's degree in economics in 1985. He later returned there to earn a master's degree in economics completed in 1991. Yeah. Yeah. If you want. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. He became involved in politics as a member of his high school's Young Liberals Club. He then became a progressive conservative but uh, became disillusioned with the party in the late 
uh, 1980s or mid 1980s uh, eventually he joined the Reform Party of Canada first led by Preston Manning <clears throat> Uh, in his parliamentary term from 1993 to 1997, he was a prominent member of the Reform Caucus or Parliamentary Group. He has expressed social conservative views on some issues uh, opposing uh, same-sex marriage, although he favors uh, registered partnerships. Um, he also has been somewhat critical of gun control. <clears throat> so he twice prorogued the parliament first in uh, December 2008 when the three opposition parties threatened to topple it on a vote of no confidence and then uh, in December 2009 Uh, the first prorogation was allegedly necessary for, so that he could get on with governing Canada with a new mandate <coughs> and deal with the economic crisis. <coughs> and then the second one supposedly was necessary for Canada's economic plan. It coincided with the uh, partly with the 2010 Winter Olympics. Uh, in late March 2011, the Parliament uh, or the House of Commons passed <coughs> a contempt of Parliament <coughs> no confidence vote against Harper, triggering the May 2011 parliamentary elections, which the Conservatives won. <coughs> However, the next parliamentary elections were won by the Liberals. Both uh, the Liberal leader uh, Justin Trudeau and the New Democratic leader Thomas Mulcair accused uh, Harper of mismanaging Canada's economy, among other issues. Um, in March 2018, he attended the International Fellowship of Christians and Jews Gala at Mar-a-Lago where he stated that he expressed support for U.S. President Donald Trump's uh, speech on Jerusalem. He also expressed later that year support for Trump's decision to withdraw from the Iran deal by lending a signature to an ad that appeared in the New York Times a day after the decision. Um, in the 2009 to 2010 um, fiscal year, the uh, Canadian annual budget deficit was over $55 billion, an unenviable, unflattering Canadian record. Although in 2014 to 15, uh, the federal budget was balanced with a surplus of $1.9 billion. The 15 to 16 fiscal year ended with a $1 billion deficit, and since then Canada has had a rising deficit. Uh, he had close relations with, for example, the United States uh, and Australia during his prime ministership. Since Harper's government took office in 2006, Canadian greenhouse gas emissions fell from 749 to 726 uh, mt of carbon dioxide equivalent. Starting in 2006, the Harper government implemented policies that had the effect of reducing transparency. So he was accused of uh, encouraging or at least tolerating corruption.